Okay, so welcome to this uh, MailerLite uh, tutorial. Uh, uh, this is a platform that that I use uh, to automate my email uh, email marketing uh, processes and systems. So, uh, of course, I chose to do a tutorial about uh, MailerLite because. Uh, number one, it has a, as of now, it has a forever free uh, plan, and uh, there, there are so many other, there are so many other platforms that also have free plans. However, MailerLite gives you so much more with its forever free plan, so much more than other uh, uh, email marketing uh, platforms. So uh, I will not take you through the sign up process because. Uh, if you've applied for these platforms, the sign-up process is the same. It's similar. You sign up, and then you create, uh, you put in your details, and then they will send you a confirmation link into in your inbox. And then uh, after that, of course, they'll take some time to confirm. Uh, of course, you can start testing out the platform immediately. However, uh, they will take some time, let's say a day or two, uh, to to authenticate your your, your account. Uh, they have to check if your website is correct, your social media, all, all the details you put in to see that they match their standards. Now I have to say this, uh, MailerLite's, uh, MailerLite's uh, uh, acceptance uh, uh, process is, uh, is quite tough. They don't just allow anyone in. Uh, they have to make sure that the, that uh, number one you don't want to sp uh, you're not one of those spammers uh, that your business is um, is legit and that uh, you're running a clean operation they have to make sure so they have to check they they uh, it's not that easy for them to 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 accept uh, your account creation process however in the meantime as they they check they allow you to test their platform so go ahead and sign up and then uh, start to check out their platform and go along with me as I show you uh, what, uh, what they have to offer and how to, to start to automate your processes, how to create, account, how to create uh, email campaigns, how to automate, how to create pop-ups, how to uh, create forms, um, how to create a website with MailerLite. And you know, there's, there's so many things that they have to offer, all at no cost, okay? so. Do that, and then we shall jump into uh, how to use MailerLite. So after you have uh, confirmed your email, uh, you should be you should be able to access your account, which should look something like this, which should, which of course will look different from mine, since mine has been active for some time and I already have subscribers, I have some campaigns that are already running. Uh, yours will not look like this. Uh, I'm sure yours will also tell you that they are still reviewing uh, your details. Uh, in case they reject your account, uh, you can send me an email. Uh, there will be a link. There will be an email link in the description below this video. Send me an email and I can request them to, to, to authenticate your account. Since I already hold, uh, hold uh, have an account with them, uh, I've helped other people to create an account to create accounts with them so in case they reject your request um, send me an email but also send me the links to your website to your social media so that I'm sure that I'm dealing with uh, someone who 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 is doing the right thing okay and then I can request them to activate your account for you okay now moving on uh, of course when you look at uh, my dashboard uh, as of now, the, the free account allows up to a thousand subscribers. Beyond that, uh, you begin to pay uh, the price, uh, the, the fees accordingly. Uh, you will begin to pay uh, a thousand at a thousand subscribers. You have to start paying ten dollars per month. Then between a thousand to two five hundred is fifteen, and so on and so forth. Now. So this is what you will have in the free version. You are allowed up to a thousand subscribers, and then uh, you are allowed uh, twelve thousand emails per month. So in other words, till you hit a thousand subscribers, you could use this platform 
forever that's why it's called a forever free plan so until you hit a, a thousand subscribers that's when you will be able to that's when you will you can you can upgrade you can pay the ten dollars okay now uh, moving on so in uh, mailer light you will have campaigns what this means these are ordinary emails one-off emails where you 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 prepare an email and send it off or you schedule it to go at a particular time okay then subscribers these are the emails that you receive from people uh, so when you go under subscribers you will see uh, the people have who have so far given you their names and email addresses so those are subscribers so how you get the subscribers you could maybe let's say you have a seminar and people fill in forms and then you just come and upload uh, into MailerLite okay then forms these are the these could be pop-up forms these are the let's say you go to someone's website and they are telling you uh, to to subscribe to a newsletter that section where you put in your email address and name that's a form and then sites of course now there are some of you who do not have websites yet or or you don't have landing pages you can use MailerLite to create your website and sites and I mean and landing pages and then you can begin to use those to drive traffic to generate leads for and, and get subscribers so that you begin to target these people with information with education and with your promotions okay now automations is where you have uh, is where you set up a sequence or, or a, uh, a set of emails that are triggered by by uh, by your subscribers uh, behavior yeah so let's imagine that a subscriber receives your email and then uh, they open the email so you could set it up in such a way that in case someone opens an email they receive a particular set of emails in case they don't open that email they receive a particular set of emails you could also set it up in such a way that it just goes every uh, the sequence goes every two days for example you could say that in, in case someone opts into a form, a particular form, they start receiving uh, a sequence every two days. Okay? Then you could also set it up in such a way that in case someone buys a product or reaches a certain uh, URL, then the, a certain uh, sequence of emails is triggered. So that's, that's what happens in automations. Okay? So let's get into it.